It's the start of a new year, and just like years past, the number one resolution is to hit the gym and get in shape. But as Mike Manzoni explains, there are things you need to know before you sign up. For so many of us, New Year's resolutions always bring us to the gym. You feel so good after you work out. That's one of the reasons a lot of us end up signing up for memberships only to give up on our workout routine within weeks. They lack the, the guidance. They think it's impossible. And their goal setting is kind of unrealistic. Jack Do30 is a personal trainer at Excel Fitness in Spartanburg. He says the key is to be patient and not expect results overnight. And you can see changes, whether it's blood pressure, um, energy level, and I'm always pointed out to him. David Gavalis works out at least four days a week, and he'll be the first to tell you. That's really hard. Just a few years ago, he joined a gym after the start of the year and slacked off. Yeah, I'll taper off a little bit. You know, I'll just I'll go off on my diet. I'll not work out for like a week. I just like, man, I gotta get back in the gym and start working out again. But before you hit the weights, it's important to read the fine print and know your options. South Carolina law allows you to cancel your gym membership contract by midnight on the third business day after you sign the contract. All you have to do is send your request in writing via certified mail, then the gym must give you back your money. If you decide to stick it out, remember. It is a destination. You got to work for something. And it begins with one lift at a time. In Spartanburg, Mike Manzoni, 7 News. Fitness experts also say it's a good idea to try a gym out before you sign up for a membership. Many gyms offer day, week, and month passes so you can see if you like it before you commit.